Hi, it's Joey from Day Job Hacks. Today's video, I want to go over landing pages and squeeze pages. It's going to be a quick guide to landing pages and squeeze pages, how to set them up quickly without a lot of technical skills. Now, when I'm running campaigns, I'm constantly testing and tweaking new landing pages by A, B split testing. So this can take a lot of time if you don't have the tools available to make this quick, okay? I'm also going to talk about some of the key components of the landing pages and squeeze pages that work really well in terms of converting into leads or customers. Customers, okay, so we're gonna dive into my computer. We're gonna look at the tools that you can use that can quickly build new landing pages fast that look really professional for all of your marketing campaigns. And then we're gonna go over some of the steps involved in getting these set up quickly. All right, here we are inside my computer. Now, what I wanted to show quickly here is that, you know, I'm constantly testing landing pages every single day in every single campaign. That takes a lot of time and energy. So I wanna show you some tricks on how to set up landing pages quickly, how to edit them, what tools to use, and how you can start doing this on, you know, on the fly when you're running traffic, especially when you're running paid traffic, extremely important to test landing pages, okay? So as you can see here, uh, I always label a control page. This is CPV Lab Stat here I, I set up landing pages in there and I use that to track my landing pages when I'm sending traffic to them as you can see I have a control page I've tested number two it failed tested number three it's not quite as good as the control page so I will pause these two and again create a new landing page constantly testing okay that is uh, how we find winning campaigns and winning with pages so let's go and look at uh, a couple examples so to set up landing pages first of all you need to have a server uh, or a hosting company, whatever you use, okay? So for me, I use Liquid Web. This is um, the, the, the program I use. They have a really good dedicated server that I can use for, for high traffic campaigns and they have extremely good support. So I would totally suggest these people if you are running high traffic. Now for people that are just starting out, they don't wanna spend the extra money, bluehost.com is extremely easy to set up. You get a free domain. You can start for as little as five bucks a month or 523 a month. So very cheap and affordable um, and it works. It works well and you don't need to worry about, um, you know, crashing or anything like that. If you're running, you know, uh, let's say you could probably run 5,000 clicks a day on this easily and you wouldn't have any problems. So I would uh, start there if that is something that, um, you know, if you're just starting out. So once you sign up to these hosting companies, then you're gonna have uh, what is called the cPanel, okay? So when you log into your hosting company, you're gonna go to the cPanel and you're gonna see something that looks like this, okay? Now this is the cPanel for dayjobhacks.com, which is my website um, that I use in a lot of examples when I'm doing these videos, Dayjob Hacks, okay? So once you have your cPanel, there's, two, there's a couple ways you can deliver your landing pages. Now, some people will, you know, opt out of having their own hosting company and they'll, you know, go to places like, we'll say, ClickFunnels, okay, where they host your landing pages and all that stuff for you. Now, you're going to be paying a lot of fees every single month. Um, you're not going to have full control and ownership over your website. So I don't use ClickFunnels. I use my own server. Therefore, I have this cPanel here that I need to, you know, set up. But it's extremely easy and I'm going to show you how quick it can be to set up your landing pages, okay? So once you're in here, Really, all you need to do is go to FTP accounts, create yourself an account under your name, um, call it whatever you want. In, in this case, you know, I would call it, uh, let's say, Joey at Day Job Hacks, create a password, and then you're going to leave this blank and you're going to create the FTP account. Okay, simple as that. Now, once you have your, C, uh, your FTP account set up, you simply come down here, you'll see that it's already set up here. Configure FTP client. Now this is gonna be, this is gonna allow me to transfer files onto my server so that they go live on the internet. Very easy to do. There's actually a free program that you can use to do this and it is called FileZilla. And you'll see right here the free FTP solution and you want to download the FileZilla client and install that. Once you have it on your computer, you will open it up and here you go, this is what you're going to see, okay? Now what this is is basically once you've connected to your server, so to connect to your server from this program, you're just gonna click on file, you're gonna click on site manager, okay? And then you're going to enter your host name, in this case it's ftp.dayjobhacks.com, and then I'm gonna put my username and my password, and then I'll hit connect, and once I do that, 
you're going to see that it connects. Now, it's already been connected, but here, here we go. This is my server over here on the right side, okay? So these are all the files that are currently on my server. And over here on the left side are the files that are currently on my computer, okay? So it's very um, easy to move files back and forth from my own local PC or my local computer over to the server, okay? So now, if you want to set up landing pages, I'm going to show you two ways that are extremely simple to set up landing pages, okay? So the first way is to upload or download a landing page template and then upload it to your server, okay? So here, I'm going to show you that. So if you go to powerhouseaffiliate.com in the members area, we have what are called landing page templates. These are templates that we offer to our premium members, and you can basically download any of these landing page templates. Now these templates will only work if you upload them to your server and deliver them through your server. You can't upload most of, like these are pages that are built in HTML or PHP. You cannot upload them into a, a program like WordPress and think that it's going to work because WordPress uses its own themes. Same for, um, Thrive Architect. They have their own themes. You have to have a WordPress theme in order to use those programs, okay? So these templates here are in fact HTML templates. They're very easy to use, okay? So I'm going to pull one up. Um, we'll use this listicle here for seven gadget listicle, okay? So in Powerhouse Affiliate, you can click on it and it'll show you, you know, what it looks like, okay? This is the listicle and these are all affiliate offers and this is a landing page built to run e-com offers. This works extremely well. Listicles are a great type of landing page and we have a lot of them inside here, okay? So now if I wanna use this, I don't go and try and upload it to Thrive Architect. I don't try and upload it to WordPress. I basically upload it to my server, okay? So to do that, I simply um, download it. So let's go back here. I'm gonna download the actual um, landing page. So here we go, save it. Now I need to extract that because it's in zip format. So I use a program here, um, hold on here. WinRAR is the program I use. This is what you'll see when you open it. And I just want to extract that, okay? So you can use Windows to extract and all that kind of stuff too. Very easy to do. Click okay. Now it's been extracted. Now I'm going to go back into FileZilla and I should now see over here this seven awesome gadgets in my downloads folder on my computer open that up and find this section here this is all the website files okay now to put this live on the internet i basically look over here on my server and i find the folder called public html double click on that so it opens these are all folders inside my public html what i want to do is i want to right click and click create directory okay so this is going to be the directory where my landing page is so let's just call it seven gadgets okay seven gadgets is the name of that directory so now you'll see there's the directory and i'm going to double click that and now i'm inside the seven gadgets directory all i do is i select all of these files here and i drag them over let them load into the server and now, when I go to dayjobhacks.com slash seven gadgets, that landing page is going to be live, okay? Let's just do that now. dayjobhacks.com slash seven gadgets. And there you go. The, this page is now live, it is a landing page, and it is ready to go. However, it is not technically ready to go because all of these links need to be edited. So how do I do that? Well, there's a couple easy ways to do that. One of the easiest ways is to just go into your cPanel and click on the home of area of cPanel, go into File Manager, click on the public HTML again, go into the folder 7 gadgets, and you wanna select this file and click Edit, okay? It's going to bring up the code. Now don't get scared here. If you're not a coder, it doesn't matter. Just don't change anything without fully understanding what you're changing here. What you're looking for in this page is the simple links out, okay? And you're looking for the ahref hashtag here. This is the link out. Anything that says ahref equals, and then it's there's a link here. In this case, it's just a hashtag because this is a template. What you wanna do is you wanna select this part here 
and you want to change all of those to your affiliate link. So let's say um, your, your, the, the first offer is a flashlight. So here you're going to have your link for your flashlights. So you're going to have your like HTTPS slash whatever your, your domain is dot com slash flashlight affiliate link, whatever, right? Well, let me just type that right because it doesn't affiliate link, whatever, okay? So then you're just going to do that. That's your link that is going to give you commissions when anybody ever clicks on it, okay? So now once you've changed all your links, you can click save changes and now those are going to be applied to your website. So when you refresh your page, now all of your links are going to be your affiliate links. Now a quick way to do this if you're using a page that's only promoting one offer. Now this is a listicle, so you're gonna have to go through each single one to change the links. But on a on a page that has one offer and you just want to switch all the links, just select the actual um, domain here. Or what you'll want to do is you want to, in this case, you want to select this this section, hold down your control button and hit H, and you'll see here over here it brings up the what I've selected here. So what I want to do is I want to copy that and put that here. But I want to change this to my HTTPS affiliate link dot com, whatever your affiliate link is here, okay? And make sure you have the quote there. So, and then you're gonna see, you can see now there's 36 placements where this is on the page. It's going to replace them, and then you click all, and it just basically replaced all of them, okay? So you'll see now it says zero. There's none left. I've basically replaced all the links. And if you go through here now, you're going to see all of the links have been replaced by this um, .com. And there's actually an extra quote by mistake. So I'm going to have to fix that. Um, easy to fix. I would just select all of this um, here. If I see, you know, .com with two quotes, I'm going to hit Control H again. And I want to replace all those with com one quote. Let's replace all that. So now I've fixed the problem. Here we go. You can see now all of the links have a href equals quote my link end quote and then the target blah, 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 all that stuff, all the coding. Okay, so that's easy. Now that page is basically live. If I refresh it, all the links now are going to my, um, to my affiliate link. Okay, so if I click save changes, refresh, now you see when I look down in the bottom left corner, all of my links are showing affiliate link.com. So that's basically how you do it. Now, if you ever want to change something on this page, simply just, you know, go in there and find the headline and change that in your cPanel and you're good to go. So that is the first way to do a landing page. Let's look at some more simple, effective ways to make landing pages if you don't want to get into this. Okay, now there are tools available and the best tool, in my opinion, is the one I'm going to show you now. And it's the one that I use here on Day Job Hacks. I use it on probably about 12 different websites that I'm using in terms of paid traffic. When I send paid traffic, I'm creating landing pages quickly using what's called Optimize Press. Now this is built on WordPress. It's a WordPress plugin. So when you're on your server um, hosting, okay, you need to install WordPress onto your domain. And that is very easy inside cPanel. Um, instead of going into file manager, when you log into your cPanel, the first thing you're going to want to do is go to WordPress and you want to install WordPress here, right here, click install now, and then choose where you want to install it and go through the simple wizard and boom, you've got WordPress. And that's what I've done here on day job hacks. This is on WordPress. However, what I also did was when I was inside WordPress and I logged in, I installed these two plugins here. One of them is optimized press. 2.0 here and this is optimized press 3.0 so here is the one that is important because um, this allows me to actually build landing pages okay so I've also used this on another site that I use uh, for examples here which is keto 25 day keto challenge uh, I also use optimized press and built this landing page here um, using templates inside so here I'm just going to show you quickly why this tool is so effective so when you come in, uh, let's just go into this one, 25 Day Keto Challenge. For example, if I was to come in here and click Create New Page, now I can create a landing page quickly using templates, okay? Now these templates are extremely professional and they're easy, super easy to fix um, into whatever offer or affiliate 
promotion you're doing, whatever. You have video sales pages, you have lead pages here, you have um, you know articles, all this kind of stuff that you can use here. You have the you know this type of landing page that has the timer on it. These are all key elements that you need to, to you know to drastically increase your conversion rates. These are built by professional marketers. So now you don't have to go in and try and build these pages yourself. You basically work from a template and you just basically change the wordings on these to whatever you're promoting. So let's just use an example here. If I was to say I'm uh, promoting a product, um, let's say I'm promoting a free affiliate marketing training course. Let's say you're an affiliate for Powerhouse Affiliate and you know, you're know you trying to promote our product and you want to use a template. So you come in here and you would say affiliate training, we'll say, that's the name of it. So this tool is kind of similar to ClickFunnels, okay? Um, except you don't have to pay your constant monthly fee and you don't have to worry about not owning your data and all that stuff, okay? Everything here is now on your own server. You have full control. Um, if, if things go down, you just, you know, contact your serving company, server company, or you can fix it yourself. Okay. So, and look, it has everything that you need. It has a nice big uh, headline here. It has the call to action above the fold. It has um, things here that shows, you know, that this has social proof, it, you know, it's, it's, it's been out there, all that kind of stuff, the ratings. These are all things that would require a really good designer to do. Now you can basically just do it using Optimize Press 3.0. Look, it has other uh, headlines, H H1s, H2s. It's good for SEO, all of that stuff. Everything about this is good. There's They're loading faster. So I, this is why I use it. Very easy to fix. So if I want to change this to, say, uh, free affiliate training, you just simply highlight it and say, okay, free affiliate training, right? I can change all this stuff. And then when I go on this thing here, I wanna change that to say my affiliate link. I can change that by just clicking this button. I can change it to a link URL, put whatever my affiliate link here, all that kind of stuff. When I'm done, I click save. And basically this page would go live as soon as I hit saved. Uh, let's just, uh, have a look here. So you come back in here and you just, this is a draft right now. If I want to publish it live, I could simply do that and click publish, but I can see the preview here. So basically there's the page and that is how quick it can be to set up your landing pages. Okay. Very quick and easy. You can use these templates to kind of test and tweak different landing pages. And what you can also do is once you've created your page perfectly the way you want it, you can come back into all pages and then clone them or duplicate them, okay? So then you can just duplicate it, bring it up, edit it, um, change a few things, and then split test it again. So that is how I rapidly create landing pages and split test them, is I'm not building out a new page every single time. I'm kind of creating one once, <clears throat> and then I'm tweaking and testing different elements of this landing page, okay? So the, the last thing that people tend to do is they upload, um, other themes to WordPress. Now there's other plugins and themes that you can use. WordPress uses themes, so you can't just take a landing page template from say Powerhouse Affiliates um, you know, library here. You can't just take one of these pages, download it, and upload it as a theme to WordPress. <coughs> WordPress uses its own themes. If you wanna build landing pages on WordPress, you need a plugin and you need to use the plugins templates, which is what I've just shown you basically. Um, here on this uh, sample using Optimize Press 3.0. So just as a conclusion, um, to recap, there's a whole bunch of different pages available in here in templates. So you, you, know, you can see the key elements of all landing pages and legacy. They have the legacy templates, membership pages, launch pages. So if you're doing a product launch, they have templates here for you in terms of uh, you know, having like comments, Facebook comments, social proof, all that kind of stuff here, video sales page, webinar pages. This is what um, you should be using, especially if you're just starting out because all of the key elements, like I said, are on these pages. So you don't have to learn, you know, the key marketing tactics that you need to understand in order to get conversions. This is all done for you just in different niches, but you, you can simply change these to whatever niche you're in. So if you're doing something about pets and you don't see anything here about pets, 
then just take the key elements of this landing page and change it to you know a, a, a nice headline a nice secondary headline change the image and you'll have a nice landing page about whatever offer you're pitching all right i hope you enjoyed the short guide on landing pages and squeeze pages if you did please subscribe to my channel click the little bell icon so you get notified every time i post a new video and we'll see you in the next videos